Okay, um, I wanted to know uh, if you could tell us about those past two days um, and what you did here in Saumur and tell us about the Journée du Complet a bit. Um, we have been in Saumur for the past two days um, thanks to France Complet because they organized two days of um, yeah, eventing seminar and um, it was a very interesting mix of discussion rounds indoor and uh, clinics in the arena or outdoor where we have been um, talking about various things starting from horse behavior, signs of stress, um, towards um, basic dressage training with the help of a vet, how to um, warm up or train a horse according to his body, um, trying to find solutions for every horse um, or situation, um, went on to show jumping, um, trying to find exercises for different sort of horses or also their body or natural abilities. Um, we compared uh, eventing and dressage to normal dressage to find out that there's actually no big difference. Um, went on with uh, some fun indoor cross country and this morning we finished with um, introducing young horses to skinny jumps or technical questions on the cross-country course outdoor um, and especially interesting I thought was that we in between had um, yeah lots of talks discussions with other people about different topics of the sport also big topic um, the Olympics uh, how well why what could Paris do for our sport how might it possibly change uh, the format for the Los Angeles Olympic Games and um, then very yeah always current topic is the mm, economy in the sport how does it work for different people I talked a little bit about how my system um, and it's interesting to see that there's in the end uh, no very big difference between the countries and everyone is um, more or less facing the same um, difficulties Brilliant. thank you um, at the end of the day how would you reflect on the theme of those two days so the journée du complet the theme was uh, giving a new birth to eventing uh, through uh, the rise of the Olympics and everything. How would you reflect on that topic? Well, I think um, working with horses, being in horse sport, um, we always have to uh, reflect what we're doing. Uh, we always have to try to get better, um, to educate ourselves. And if you look at the Olympics and the constant the worry, will we stay in Olympic uh, discipline or not? It's very important that we keep thinking ahead, that we try to um, yeah, always get better in what we're doing, that we have in mind not only ourselves and our bubble, but also the people around. So um, looking onto the topic from the perspective of uh, well, horse welfare, educating ourselves and the riders, and then thinking how, what can we do to always improve our sport, uh, help the riders in the sport, and uh, discuss how we can make the sport more approachable um, or more easy to understand to other people. It's, it's a very, very big topic, but I think we had some very good um, shots at it and started it nicely this weekend. Thank you so much. Could you use maybe one word or a small sentence to summarize those two days and, and finish the interview? Um, well, for me, these two days have been very interesting, informative, and... Uh, interesting new contacts um, in the sport and I hope they will pass the way for something in the future. Thank you so much, Judy. Thank you.